Harrell's projected win on Tuesday is a stark contrast from the race in 2018, where Tora Small beat Harrell by about 3,700 votes. That narrow margin may have been closed by an increase in Republican voters in southern New Mexico. A lot of money was also poured into this race. Both candidates and their outside PAC shelled out about $30 million into winning this race. Harrell credits the Republican stronghold in District 2 for helping her to the victory. This is very much a pro Second Amendment district, a pro life district, and I do believe that uh, does play a role in this race. Um, people know me as, you know, pro God, pro life, pro business, pro gun, pro family legislator. Now, ads from both campaigns relied heavily on appealing to rural gun owners in southern New Mexico. Torres Small was only the second Democrat to hold the seat in 40 years. The unofficial results from the Secretary of State's office has Harold finishing eight points over Torres Small.